we're all trying to project how much better the 49ers are going to be with Trey Lance this season than they were last year with Jimmy Garoppolo. One useful way to do this projection is to look at the Rams, who are very similar to the 49ers. In 2020, the Rams had Jared Goff as their starting quarterback, who is like the unhandsome version of Jimmy Garoppolo. I mean, that's a fair thing to say. He went 9-6 in 2020. He threw 20 touchdown passes and 13 interceptions. The next year, the Rams bring in Matthew Stafford. He goes 12-5, and five, throws 41 touchdown passes, 17 interceptions, wins the Super Bowl. The Rams go from a top 25 quarterback to a top 10 quarterback, win three more games in the Super Bowl. A lot more touchdown passes. Big difference. Um, okay, now let's look at the Niners. Jimmy Garoppolo, top 25 quarterback, the handsome Jared Goff, 2021 goes 9-6, and six, 20 touchdown passes, 12 picks, terrible in the playoffs, falls short. Almost an exact same stat line as Jared Goff. Now you got Trey Lance, who could he be a top 10 quarterback in his first season as a starter? Maybe. If he, could he win 12 games this year? Could he take this team from a 10-win team to a 12 or a 13-win team, kind of like Matthew Stafford did for the Rams? Maybe. Could he have 14 touchdown passes this year? Maybe he could have 14 combined touchdowns when you combine when you factor in what he's going to score on the ground. I think maybe we're underselling just how big of a leap the Niners offense is going to make this year with Trey Lance. Because I think maybe we're romanticizing what Jimmy Garoppolo did. He's just the handsome Jared Goff. He was really underperforming. And just going... Lance doesn't have to be a top five quarterback. If he's just top 10, top 15, this offense is going to make a, a big jump. So the sky's the limit. 